need to get to the other side somehow. the tower courtyard heading up to the top stay put i'm almost there yeah well I, I don't see an off switch on this lift so stay put yes we're going in Show yourself, font of Yonkau. I draw you forth through the power of Thradako, the binding stone. We've got a problem. What is it? More like who? Sandrax here. What? Hold your position. I'm on my way. He'll be gone by then. That was an order, Initiate. Say again? I'm losing you. You do know I can just see you waving your hand around, right? An immortal. Welcome, brother. Do you know who I am? Sandrak. I suppose Kirkin has poisoned you against me by now. She didn't have to. Your men killed my family. Did they? I have no memory of that. A great many people have died in this war. Would it comfort you to know that I'm close to ending it? Don't turn your back on me! Send him to his family. I need more time to finish this. Let me give you a hand. Hey, stop!
is this place? Wait, this is the Shrouded Realm. Uh-oh, is that... the Pentasod? Sandrak and the Hand vanished when I arrived. He cast some kind of spell. I, I tried to stop him. You were supposed to wait for me, Initiate. The Ley Line, he... He absorbed it. I don't understand. I saw something. Saw what? When his spell was cast, I... I left m my body. I... I went somewhere else. Out with it. I saw the Pentasod. It, it's alive. I don't, don't think I have a talk. spell for that. Up there, Sandrak referred to me as a brother. And not like, oh, hey, look, it's another Magnus, but more like... Like someone from his order. Exactly. Complicated subject. One I'm not going to get into here. You're not going to explain how Sandrak is an immortal. Was. You're not going to explain how Sandrak was an immortal. Thought I made that clear, Initiate. That's something Kirkin will talk to you about when she thinks it's right. You know, I've got to tell you, the secrets you guys are keeping from me, they're getting old. Magni caused the wound. Ley lines can, I guess, be absorbed. And the middle one was thought to be impossible. And how would I know that? I should just go. Wait a minute. Listen. About your vision. Of the Shrouded Realm. Yeah. The Pentasod. It is alive. All we ever see here, in this world, in our world, is only the physical manifestation. In Kalthus, our mystics say this form visits them in dreams in the winter. So I'm a saint. I just wanted you to know that you're not- And I'm not special? No worries. Can you ever shut up? I'm saying you don't have to feel alone, Jack. I don't want you to feel like you might become a pariah. So you're going to start calling me Saint Jack is what I'm hearing. You're impossible. You're impossible Saint Jack. Give it a whirl. Don't forget that saints usually end up dying in horrible ways. All right, I'll meet you back at the Palathon. Sandrak absorbing a ley line isn't something we're even remotely prepared for. Heard you walk right up into a whole thing. Take up a position at the table, Initiate. There's a lot to talk about. Any of these people. Sounds like Zendara filled you in, sir. But I've got about a million questions. Story time, Jack. And I used to really love story time. The Shrouded Realm is a world of raw, untempered magic. A magic so formless and wild, it's impossible to master. Yeah, I think I've been there. Then the Pentasad came to that world and created the Fonts, five great anchors that connected the Shrouded Realm to Avium. 
the ley lines spread out from these fonts traveling through both worlds, turning the Shrouded Realm's magic into a resource we could use. If someone could capture the power of a font, they'd control magic in a way that no Magnus has before. Like a living ley line tower, capable of drawing magic from the very source, capable of even redirecting it away from other Magni. Sandrak has done exactly that. We believe he's in possession of a Thrada Cull, a binding stone, an artifact that can control the fonts. So that's what I saw the hand pull out of the ruins. That's right. With it, Sandrak will eventually be able to block our access to magic completely. Then the Everwar is over. Over? As in he takes over Lucium? As in he takes over everything. Sir, respectfully, and whatever, you're wrong. Excuse me? Oh boy. You said it yourself. Magic is a resource. Just because Sandrak absorbed a font or whatever doesn't mean his power is endless. It's just that it's probably ginormous. If he found a way to use the Binding Stone, so can we. We can take it back and then... at home I bring you good news sister peace is near allow me to let you witness it a small kindness between friends if you would have it we were just discussing what the best response would be to your desecration of the fonts had you yet concluded you have none Let us meet at Nosea to discuss the terms of your surrender. I hear now you speak for your king. So there should- <coughs> Chat! <clears throat> the boy does not know me. You have my word. The traditions of Aristea will be upheld. Without violence. I see a Lucium that genuinely survives this part of history. Well, that was horrible. Course of action? Devin, make sure every last trace of them is really gone. Zandara, I need you to speak to the Watch Commanders. We're meeting Sandrak at Nosea. We're outgunned. Not outfought. Not yet. Jack, let's talk. Is Zandara right? We're going to actually walk into Sandrak's trap. Sir, I know you don't plan- Not even a little bit. Okay, so it's our trap, then. The Immortals can't let Sandrak take control of magic, Jack. Speaking of the Immortals and Sandrak, and Sandrak having been an Immortal and- I figured this was coming. There's not a lot of time here. I had a right to know. You recruited me the day Sandrak destroyed my home. What difference would it have made? I don't know. How do you benefit by constantly keeping secrets from me? You joined the army, Jack, not the academy. I don't feel that's a good enough answer, sir. I'm sure you can live with it for the time being, if we survive Nosea. Now, a few pieces need to fall into place for the- A portal stone. Selko will know what to do. Understood. Good. With the most dangerous man alive just strolling into the Palathon briefing room. From a I guess you're not. I'm just saying there's a lot to unpack there. Okay, I I'm gonna go. Wait, Jack, l listen. I know you have a grudge, to put it probably too lightly, but. But don't. Well, you know, let all that cloud your judgment when we try and. <laughs> backstab him at Nosea. There's no word, really, for the kind of power he wields. Sandrax got. You're right. Father hated a coward. Okay, yeah, you know, this... I'm sorry. I really need to get it together. Sir? About Nosea? Definitely not now, Initiate. 
Whatever plans the Grand Magnus has... I get the feeling you won't like them. It's... not my call. spell for that. So, uh, Kirkin didn't say what that thing does. Probably better you don't know. Is it, though? If you got captured. Sure, sure. It's just... If I knew the whole plan, it could be helpful. You have a point. You aren't going to tell me, are you? Nope. Great. See you around, Captain. Jack, Kirkin's asking for an update. I delivered the portal stone to Captain Selko. What's next? Rendezvous with the rest of us at Nosea. Our parlay with Sandrak is imminent. Parlay? What? Never heard anyone actually use that word. It's the nerves. Uh-huh. See you soon.
it's Nosia up ahead. Game face, Jack. Can I call dibs? Not the time, Jack. So, what's the plan? To know, this all feels a bit improvisational, if I'm being honest. You bring no banner? Didn't feel the need. <laughs> I held a small hope you might see reason. Yet you remain the same Kirken that made me abandon the Immortals years ago. Obsessed with victory. Stranger to compromise. Your eye ever bent towards the world's ruin. And you just want to save it. I can! With this. Its mastery over the fonts means I can end the war. You mean win the war? By turning the rest of us defenseless? In our every meeting, a yipping pup. Jack's right, though. You're not worthy of that power, Sandrak. Your airships bomb the free cities of the East and then wonder why they resist you now? The last order that surrendered to Rasharn, you burned their ambassadors alive. If my eye is ever bent towards the world's ruin, it's because I'm trying to stop the man causing so much of it. Please, don't make me do this. Captain Selko. You went mad. You didn't abandon us. You were exiled. And I'm still paying the price for not killing you. Remember, this blood is on your hands. It's the wound! He's moving it! We have to go! Now! Fall back! Devin. Jack, glad you're on your feet. That could have been so much worse. Took ages, but Zandara was finally able to dig you out of the rubble. Oh, no, not her. I rather would have died. I'm never living that down. Nope. Never. How many did we lose? Considering Sandrak just dropped a city into the wound, surprisingly few. But enough to have made his point. Kirkens left for Lavnery to talk with the king. He wants a full surrender after Nosea. There's even talk that Kirkin's emergency powers may be rescinded. So who's in charge? Uh, Zendara. And I'll warn you, she's in a bit of a mood. Kind of on brand for her. I heard that. Whoops. Meet us in the war chamber, Jack. 
We've come to the conclusion that we're in desperate need of a plan. Kirkin may be gone, but our job's still the same. Eliminating Sandrak and his hold over the fonts. There are five, right? He can't have them all yet. We may not know what the Binding Stone does or how Sandrak uses it, but we can try and keep him away from the rest if all of us just... What? The fonts are hidden from us, Jack. Invisible. Buried in the liminal spaces where the borders between Avium and the Shrouded Realm are weakest. We only know the location of two. The Palathon is actually built around one. And the other is in the Tower of Masks in Risharn. Which means Sandrax already used the Binding Stone to absorb its power. We have to assume he has. Technically, we now know the location of three fonts. But the one in the Pale Forest is, well... You saw what happened to it. So that leaves the last two, and only Sandrak knows where they are. Fine. Pin that. We concentrate on the Binding Stone instead. We know where that is. We just need to learn how to shut it off. And fast. Not necessarily. According to my research, a Thradical takes a huge toll on its possessor. Sandrak will have to rest before doing another stunt like that. We may have a little time. Which leads us to former Grand Magnus, Thaddeus. Kirkin's predecessor, now in exile. The oldest of us that still lives. By all accounts, he was an expert on Aristea. If there's a weakness to the very Aristean Binding Stone, he'll know about it. In theory. Mmm, sticky wicket, the situation with Thaddeus. That's not important. Kind of feels like it is. What Zendara means to say is it doesn't matter that Thaddeus hates the Immortals and everything we stand for because you'll undoubtedly figure out a way to convince him to help us. And a bonus potential setback, because the universe is cruel. Like the remaining fonts, we also don't know where Thaddeus is. His last known location was the Sky Islands of Oramin, digging through the archives at the Library of Akoth. Okay, then what are we waiting for? I go to Oramin, make nice with a friendly librarian. Actually, getting to Oramin is difficult, Initiate. You're gonna need to learn how to ride a ley line. Devin, you're running support. Walk Jack through what he needs to do to get airborne. Ready when you are, Jack. You'll need a special spell to- Why? Like Lash, only more panic, vertigo, and- The heroes, you okay? They're hard for me to pass, honestly. Call me when you have the spell, then. I think I have a spell for that.
Don't think I have a spell for that. Devin, where do I head next? I've got the spell I need to ride the ley lines. Splendid. The ley line we need to get to Ormond is close by. Heading your way then. Some view, huh? If magical post-apocalyptic vistas are your thing. What the hell happened out there? The Gatterond. Mix stupid ideas with... Wait, they did it to... Indeed. So, the mission. Go to... You ready to leave now? I think I'm good to go. Let's see if I remember how to do this. I could get used to that. Give me a portal any day. There's a very high vomit probability for me right now. Suck it up, buddy. We need to get to Jack!
I'm Jack. This is Devin. Thanks for the assist. Uh, well, what's your name? Kenzie. You're Lucians, aren't you? Also, Immortals. Just to be clear. Is that a literal thing? What? No. Uh, we can die. It's just Good. like... Good. Then stay back. Hey, 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 watch it! Jack, I may have neglected to mention that the Ormic are notoriously territorial underneath their bohemian facade. Oh, that's rich. Coming from a pampered classist jackboot masquerading as some champion of justice. <clears throat> Look, we're just looking for someone that was here a little bit ago. I love neo-anarchist Pablum as much as the next weak need revolutionary. But I think we can both admit it loses its luster when it ultimately results in the destruction of your entire kingdom. That's not what happened, and you imperialist fuckos know it. Oh, did I say kingdom? I'm sorry. I meant a failed collective that's now just a stretch of gravity challenge rocks. Maybe the next wrong-headed egalitarian social experiment with magic fares a bit better than all of this unchecked calamity. Wow. Does he always love to hear himself talk this much? Well... Jack? I mean, I can't say no. Look, how about we table the culture clash for a bit, huh? We came here on a mission to keep Sandrak from winning the Ever War. Maybe you can help us. Who? You know what? Scratch that. It's not like I care who wins that stupid war. The sooner someone does, the sooner you can all get out of Ormen. You... You don't know who Sandrak is. Nope. But I figure since you're Lucian, he's from Asharn. Same thing, really. Different flags. Same oppressive totalitarian magic-hoarding police state. Am I doing it right? Unhelpful. You're on your own. Mind the road. These chronicler constructs are everywhere. Started spilling out of the library months ago. And you'll be happy to know that there are plenty of Rasharnians around, too. You can keep trying to prove which one of you has the right to determine the lives of the rest of us. Hey, wait up. We really are here to save the world. Let her go. With the Rashanians and these chroniclers about, we really could use someone that knows the territory. I'll catch up with her and... Be nicer? Good plan. You push forward to the library and we'll meet you there. She'll come around. <laughs> 